Hi everyone, this is Miss Rakshan. How are you today? I hope you're all fine. Today, we will read another story. Are you ready? Yes. Let's start. This is our storybook. Can you tell me the title? Yes, the title is Always in Trouble. Let's begin reading. Emma's dog, Toby, was always in trouble. Look at Emma and Toby. On Monday, he got into the garbage. Oh, on Tuesday, he ran into the road. Oops, be careful, Toby. It's dangerous. On Wednesday, he ate a loaf of bread that Emma's dad had just baked. No way. And on Thursday, he barked in the middle of the night. <gasps> Can you hear? Oh, it's too late. On Friday, he wet the rug. Oops, no. On Saturday, he chewed up all the buttons on Emma's new coat. Emma will be so angry. On Sunday, he snoozed. Oh, bye. Can you see? Yeah. On Monday morning, he got into the garbage again. Look at this mess. So dirty. Something has to be done about that dog, said Emma's mom. I think she's right. Maybe he isn't getting enough attention, said Emma. Maybe. So all day Monday, she gave Toby lots of attention. She took him for walls. <laughs> Look at them. And brushed his fur. Nice and sang him silly songs but on tuesday toby ate a box of crayons he's the same on wednesday he jumped into the basket of clean laundry that emma's mom had just finished folding oh no her mom will be so angry this time he was very good on thursday oh Really? He was very good on Friday. Okay. But it's coming. On Saturday, he chewed up a magazine. Toby's still naughty. And on Sunday, he went wading in the muddy brook and then ran across the clean kitchen floor. <gasps> Look at the kitchen floor, kids. So dirty. Something has to be done about that dog, cried Emma's mom. Yes, you should do something, Emma. Maybe he needs to go to dog training school, said Emma. Dog's training school? Good idea, I think. What a great idea said Emma's mom. Exactly. There it's go. Wow. Oh, yes, this is classroom. Can you see? <laughs> the first class started the next day. Okay. Oh, look at Toby. I think he's a little bit scared and shy. There were 10 dogs in Toby's class. Good. It means that he has friends. Some were big and some were little. Yep. Big dog. Little dog. It's very long. And some yipped and some growled and some whined. Toby was quiet as a goldfish. Really? Toby's quiet? He behaved perfectly at school every week. Well done, Toby! And he did everything just right. Wow, very good. When Emma said sit, he sat. Well, when Emma said come, he came. 
When Emma said heel, he stood right by her side. Well done, Toby. You're amazing. He was the best dog, said Mrs. Katz, the teacher. When the classes were all over, at graduation, she gave Toby a diploma with a gold seal. Wow, good. Can you see Toby's diploma here? Yep. Emma's mom tacked the diploma low down on the wall right over Toby's dog dish. Good. Now you know how to behave, she said Toby. Yes, because he learned at school. On Monday, he took out the garbage. Why? On Tuesday, he baked some bread. Really? On Wednesday, he vacuumed the rug. Amazing. On Thursday, he folded the laundry. On Friday, he washed the kitchen floor. And on Saturday, he planted the sun petunias. Incredible. And on Sunday, he snoozed. Great. But no dog can be perfect always. Not even Toby. What does it mean? Oh no. Can you see? <gasps> yes, he's running. <laughs> this is the end of the story, kids. I hope you love it. As you see, the school is so important for us, even for dogs. See you. Bye bye.